This episode is sponsored by Zazzle.com. Let's face it, you love us. Why not use the coupon code EVERYDRINK13 at Zazzle.com and save 10% off $50 or more on awesome shirts, mugs, and accessories you probably don't need but want real bad. Remember code EVERYDRINK13. Welcome to Sunday Night Shooters. I'm your host, Derek Schomer. Today, we're going to create the bull piss recipe. This recipe is submitted by Saint Forty, Saint 420, Nelson, two ounces of Jaeger, two ounces of orange vodka, and three quarters of, of a glass or of a, of a can of Red Bull, or probably your favorite energy drink, but I think a Red Bull, a Red Bull alternative. We do have Soda Stream can't, that we could do with this. But. Well, I guess, but it's called bull piss, so it has yeah. to be Red Bull. I guess this time you really should probably use Red Bull. And this recipe, by the way, is one of those that everybody has to mix Red Bull with everything. And so there's probably some danger That's in this. That's the only way to drink it. <laughs> probably true. Because Red uh, Bull is gross. And Jaeger, right? Every This is like your total college boy drink. You go to the bar and you want to do something stupid, this is it. Now, the trick is, I don't know if you're going to find orange vodka at every bar, but not Only the good ones. Yeah. If they don't have it, you should just leave. Leave. Turn around, walk right out. That's right. Oh! This is a bomb recipe. We haven't done the Irish car bomb yet, I don't think. But we can do it. We we've... did the cement mixer, though, didn't we? I don't know. We've done something like this. We've done ones where we drop them in beer. Yeah. It gets all crazy. So this one, I'm going to do two ounces of orange vodka in here. I'm going to mix that with the with the Red Bull. So there you go. Throw some ice. It's because it's nice to have things cold, right? Now, how do you know where three quarters of a can is? You gotta be good. I'm gonna be safe. Not safe with the portions, but I know that when I drop this in there, the volume of this is gonna raise this up. And the goal for me, at least, because I hate cleaning, is to not have it everywhere. If you're at the bar, who cares? Not your problem. You. The bartender will figure it out. Exactly. Because they hate cleaning too. They're getting paid. Yeah, but they get more tips if they can feed more people drinks instead of cleaning up a mess they just made. Again, not my problem. I'm just telling you how it's going to be. They will be happy because they will charge you probably three times what this really costs. So, not your problem. Now, I could measure this, but I also have a white line on my shot glasses for two ounces. So, done. That would be weird. Probably wouldn't fit. Where's this stuff made? Produced a product of Holland. So we've got Holland and Germany in the house. And I think this is Holland too, right? Energy drinks? Or, or uh, Red Bull specifically? Santa Monica, California. I don't remember where it's made. But I probably don't want to bore you with my trying to figure it out. Somebody can write in a comment, where's Red Bull? I think it's a European someplace. All right. That might still be a little heavy or a little... There could be mess involved. I don't promise any success here, but what you do is you just drop it right in there, slight amount of mess, but not too bad, and then you drink it all. It's not really a shooter. Yeah, it is. You're, You're going to do all that when gulp? No. All right. Well, you probably shouldn't have thrown the ice in there. Why not? Because it doesn't sink to the bottom. But I drank all the top off the Jaeger. As you see, as you drink, it mixes well. I kind of like that better because you get, it's not all diluting into it, right? Because it's sitting on the ice, they both pour in your mouth at the same time. They're actually mixing on the fly. Your mouth like wings is a boss and shaker. Like wings on the fly. Your mouth here. <laughs> this is quite everybody's probably already commented with an owl in the face expression it's it bites wait no, that's an 80s term <laughs> um, it's got bite like it's not giving me wings it's giving me sour face and I don't exactly I think it might just be Red Bull I don't, it's a lot of acidity orange acidic Jaeger let's try that again Ice. 
The Jaeger works out pretty well. If you don't like Jaeger, you're not gonna like this. There is a contrast someplace in there. It doesn't become a new drink. It is like citrus acids and like that the orange, because orange in this, they're kind of of the same ballpark flavor-wise, but that the Jaeger cuts right through. You're getting it almost second. It's like the second flavor you get. So you have to like it. The combination, there is a little contrast there, which is I think what gives you that face. If you could finish all of this, first off, you're gonna be bouncing off the wall or passed out. I don't know which. I don't care to find out. So I'm not gonna end up finishing that sucker off. But there you go. That's the bowl piss. If you're into that combination of drinks and understand how they mesh in a weird, crazy way. So, so I'm like guessing it. that the brown is the bowl and the yellow is the piss. Very symbolic. See, deep. That is deep. Now I, I'm going to leave this show. I'm gonna, I've taken something away from this show that I didn't even think I could get. <laughs> bowl piss. That's the bowl in the middle, and he's swimming in his own piss. Lovely. I didn't make the drink. Everyday drinkers on TV, though. That's where you can see the drink. And, uh, well, again, we're teaching you how to drink. <laughs>